and a boy. Whoa, what are those? They're flowers, duh. <sighs> Come on, I'll race you to the kitchen. I don't really feel like running right now. Do the floss, do the floss. <laughs> um, Goldie came home a little upset today and I wanted to make sure that everything was okay in school. Oh my god, I don't want to talk about it! Yay! It's recess time! Finally after a long day! Ooh! Why is there a cake? I want some cake! Miss Alexis, I'm here! I had to take a potty break, but I want to play in the playground! Hi Goldie! Can I pull your hair like yesterday? No! Go away! Come on, Goldie, it was funny. No, I don't want to! Go away! Come on, Goldie, let's play! I don't want to, you're bothering me! I just want to go and play by myself here! I want to go on the up and down thingy! I guess I'll just go and hang out here next to the trail by myself. Oh, I'm sorry about it, okay? You can come play with me if you really want to. Come on, let's go on the swings. Okay, let's go. Yay. Wee-hee. Casey, where are you? Casey. Goldie. Casey, where are you? Oh, I'm coming. Woohoo! <gasps> Goldie, are you okay? Yeah, I just ate some sand. No biggie. Woo! What are those? They're flowers, duh. Well, you know, like, um, like Valentine's Day just passed and like I'm kind of late, but I didn't want to tell you before because like I was shy and, um, well, I don't like have a crush on you or anything. I just think you're like nice, I like your hair, uh, I like your strawberry onesie. Um, I think sometimes you're funny, just sometimes, not all the time. And do you like how I do the floss? Do the floss, do the floss, do the floss, do the floss. <laughs> yeah, it's funny when you do it. Aww. Let's go on the seesaw, see and saw. And now we're stuck. Well, the bus is here. We have to go now. Let's go on the swings one last time. And then we'll run to the bus stop. Whee! Woohoo! Casey is really nice. <laughs> this is so much fun. It is, but we really have to go because the bus is going to leave us here in school. Let's run! Wait! Don't leave us! I want to go home! Come on! Casey, hurry! Okay, you want to sit with me? Oh, uh, yeah, I do. Okay, it's time to go home! Oh, no! I left the flowers! Casey gave me on the playground! Oh, well, I guess it's better I did because Casey's going to start asking all these questions and, and I don't even know how I feel about it. Oh, but I think I have a crush on Casey. But but what if Titi gets mad because I'm too little? I don't even know what to do. Oh, well, I gotta go home. Oh, I'll pretend everything is okay. Oh, Goldie's home. Hey, Goldie, how was your day? Hi, Titi. Tell me all about it. What's going on? How was your spelling test? Did you do okay? Oh, uh, yeah, I guess. Okay. Uh, is everything okay? You're acting a little bit weird. Uh, everything is fine, I guess. Are you sure? Is there anything special that happened at school today that you want to tell me? I no, I just, I went to the playground. I had art class, and then oh uh, yeah, I don't want to talk about it. Uh, okay, that definitely does not sound like everything is all right. Goldie, you know you can talk to me. Where is she? Did she lock her door? Goldie, 
can I come in? Can you please leave me alone for a little bit? Uh, okay. I'll come check up on you in a couple of minutes. That is so weird. Why is she acting like that? She usually comes back super happy from school. Hmm. I should probably call her teacher, Miss Alexis, and see if everything's okay. Hello, Miss Alexis. Yeah, it's TD. Um, Goldie came home a little upset today, and I wanted to make sure that everything was okay in school. Yeah, everything is fine. She was playing in the playground with her little friend Casey, and she looked really happy. He even got her little flowers. They are the cutest, you know? Uh, maybe Goldie has a little crush. Oh, okay, so everything else is fine? Well, well great. <laughs> Thank you so much. Huh, would you look at that? <laughs> I think I know what's going on. Goldie has a crush. And she's probably being really shy about it. Oh, this is too cute. I need to talk to her. I also don't want to be like super pushy and awkward about it, but she needs to be able to tell me these things, right? Uh, Goldie. Can I come in? I guess so if you really need to. So, I talked to your teacher, Miss Alexis. About what? Not about your day. I wanted to make sure that everything was fine. And she told me you had a wonderful day. Yeah, it was pretty okay, I guess. Um, how about we get some ice cream? I know how much you love ice cream. Come on. Ice cream makes everything better. Okay. Goldie. <laughs> Come on, I'll race you to the kitchen. I don't really feel like running right now. But you know that I really love ice cream and I could never pass up a free ice cream cone. <laughs> exactly. Let's go sit on the couch. Let's have a chat. Eat some ice cream. Talk about your day. Doesn't ice cream just make you want to talk about your feelings? What? I don't know. So Golda, you know you can tell me anything, right? Is there anything you want to talk about? I don't know, it's personal, but maybe I'll whisper it in your ear. Okay. I have a crush on a boy. Oh, Goldie, that's... I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. Oh, you guys, Goldie has her very first crush. And I think, well, I know she is very shy about it. I can remember my first crush like it was yesterday. Goldie, you know you can tell me anything. Okay, well, his name is Casey, and he's really nice, and, and he likes to dance, and he's, he's really good at drawing, and he also is learning how to play the guitar after school. Wow, it seems like you know a lot about your friend Casey. And like I really like to play with him in the playground and like he makes me smile and he gave me a flower today but I didn't bring it. I kind of forgot and I don't know because sometimes he also pulls my hair and I don't like that but I told him to stop and then he stopped and... Uh-huh. But like I don't even know if I want to like marry him or like even hold his hand. I don't know, I'm just really confused about it and it's all very weird. Well, Goldie, Casey sounds like a great little boy, and you are just a little girl, so I wouldn't worry about it. Just have fun, and it seems like he's a really nice friend. You don't have to be shy about it. I think it's totally normal, and it's nice for you to share your feelings with me. So maybe you can even invite him over for a play day one day or for lunch. That would be fun. <sighs> That would be fun. I feel much better telling you all about it because I was a little shy about it, you know? Of course. We can ask him to come over for a play date, but like after school he usually plays the guitar with his daddy and then sometimes they go to the playground and then sometimes he goes to the grocery store. So I don't know how, uh, how free he is to come have a play date with me because he looks like a busy person. Wow, Goli, you know a lot about him. I mean, just a little bit. I'm not like stalking him or anything, you know? Um, he just told me this stuff the other day at the playground. Hey guys, how about you give 
Goldie some advice on her new crush and would you like to see Goldie and Casey hanging out? Maybe having a play date or something? If so, tell me down in the comments. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next video. But tell them not to tell all their friends about my crush. It's a secret and it's personal. Okay, Goldie. Hey, did you sneak an ice cream? <laughs> see you guys next time. Woohoo, let's go play. Can't wait to see my friend Casey. You know, my crush. But I was thinking, what if Casey really likes broccoli? Um, but where's Casey? I think your hair is pretty, Laura. <gasps> Casey! I can't believe this! Casey has a crush on another girl! straighten my hair and maybe even add a little makeup today good morning TT yeah I'm already ready for school good morning but why are you holding an ice cream cone uh, it's for educational purposes only I was just practicing how I was gonna talk to Casey at school today. Um, so I'm gonna be Goldie myself, and you're gonna be Casey, okay? Uh, okay. Okay, you wait here. Good morning, Casey. How are you? Hi, I'm okay. You don't really sound like Casey. I don't know what he sounds like. Uh, okay, never mind. Okay, Casey, so look how yummy ice cream is. Look, it's so good. Much better than broccoli. Oh, okay. Look how happy it makes me. It makes me want to dance and just be super bubbly. Uh, okay, but I'm confused. Why are you telling Casey this? Because he likes broccoli. That's not a bad thing, you know? Uh, let's try this again. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Okay, but we kind of have to eat breakfast. Uh, okay, let's go. I kind of forgot I had homework. I'll read this real quick. Okay, finish it real quick and why is there a Christmas cookie on the table? Gross, I thought I got rid of these last time. All right, let's see what we have for breakfast. I haven't gone grocery shopping and we don't really have many options. How about, how about a taco? Here you go. I know it's a little weird food for breakfast, but I promise I'll go grocery shopping after work. Ok, 
Okay, well, the school bus is so outside. I'll see you after school. And bye, Goldie. Have a nice day. Good morning, everyone. Hi, Lacey. Good morning, Miss Patty. Oh, she has a cool face mask. Um, but where's Casey? Oh, I like your wings made out of post-its. Super cool. Um, where is Casey, though? I don't see him. Oh, cool glow stick. Oh, we're going to start lining up in a couple of minutes. Maybe I should go outside and see if Casey's out there and say hello. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go see. Maybe he just got off the bus late or something. Oh, I think I see him over there. Oh, hey Casey. What is he doing? He's talking to another girl. I think your hair is pretty, Laura. <gasps> Casey! Do you like wanna play in the playground with me later or something? And like play hide and seek? Mm, yeah, sure. I can like show you all of my cool dance moves and stuff. I have really good dance moves. Oh, cool. I can't believe this! Oh. <laughs> I can't believe Casey has a crush on another girl! He even told her that her hair was pretty! He told me my hair was pretty too! And now he wants to play with her in the playground! Oh, I need to hide right now! Okay, but maybe I'll get a tiny little snack. Didn't really like those tacos I had for breakfast. Maybe a little hot dog will make my belly happy or some pizza. I don't know. Maybe a burger. No, we'll have a hot dog. Yum. Hi. Hi, Goldie. I didn't see you lining up with the teacher, Miss Patty. Hello, Casey. Do you want to see my new dance? Can I show you my new dance? I have an idea. Why don't you go show Laura your new dance? I already did, but she didn't really think it was like funny and stuff. Oh, I get it. So I'm like the second option to show people your new dance. I'm not the first option, huh? What are you talking about, Goldie? I don't understand. Are you okay, Goldie? You're acting a little weird. I am fine, thank you very much. Goldie, do you maybe want to like eat ice cream with me during lunchtime? What? Uh, well, I don't even like ice cream anymore. I lied to him. I still really like ice cream. I'm just feeling a little jealous. I don't really know what's going on, but I don't like it. Maybe I am too young to have a crush on Casey. He's kind of weird sometimes, I think. So maybe I should just have fun with my friends and not be jealous when Casey talks to another girl because we're all supposed to be friends. That's what, what Miss Patty said anyway. So I'm gonna go find my friends and go to the playground. Okay, Nicole, I'll push you, and then you push me, okay? Whee! This is so much fun, let's go on the seesaw! But first, let's make a super cool slide! Whee! Yay, let's go on the seesaw, let's go on the seesaw! <laughs> <laughs> slide and then I land with my face on the sand <laughs> funny I guess but I'm playing with my friend Nicole and my friend Ava so you guys want to stay with me on the bus going home today <laughs> yay cool cool beans now it's time for a dance party Woo to the floss to the floss to the floss to the hype, to the hype, to the hype, huh, huh. You got it, friends. Woohoo! 
<laughs> the running man, you got it. Yeah, go Laura, go Nicole, go Ava. Well, let's move this party to the bus stop so we don't miss the school bus. Oh, hey Goldie, I didn't see you standing there. How was school? It was really fun! I played with my friend Nicole and my friend Ava and we had a super duper cool dance party and on the bus people were like cheering like Go Goldie! Do the hype! Woohoo! It was really fun. That's nice. Did you play with your friend Casey? Casey? Hmm? Casey who? Oh, that Casey. Well, I have some news. I don't really have a crush on him anymore. I think, I think it was a fake crush. And like, I'm totally over it, but earlier I saw him talking to another girl, Laura, and he was telling her like her hair was pretty and stuff. So like, I just had fun with my friends and it was so much more better. Um, boys are kind of complicated and I don't want to talk about that anymore and plus i had like the best time playing with my friends and having a super fun dance party on the school bus oh okay well i'm glad you had a nice day at school today plus i thought you were a little young to have a crush but how about we go get some dinner i hear they have some new flavors of ice cream over at the pier are you serious get some dinner we hope you enjoyed today's video and if you're still here at the very end of this video write in the comments school bus dance party so i know you are a true goldie bestie see you next time my friend is coming over to watch a movie anyway thanks for inviting me over for a date Oh my gosh, this is so awkward. Let's take a look at what's going on downstairs. The stars. Are, are you crying? <laughs> They're getting mighty close to each other. Are they gonna kiss? Ooh. Hi guys, it's TD and today we are in Bloxburg. Tonight I'm having a friend come over. And it's not a date or anything, it's just a friend coming over to like hang out and watch a movie. You guys might remember him from the time that we thought somebody broke into our house. The nice police officer that came to help us. Well, after it happened, he was kind of like calling me and I think he has a crush on me. But And he wanted to go out to like dinner, but I couldn't because I have to stay here with Goldie. So I figured I would invite him over. And I want to change up my look for it tonight, but I don't know what to wear. You guys know that the options are quite limited here in Bloxburg. This is a fashion no. Uh, this is so difficult. Okay, I'm going to settle for this outfit. It's kind of simple. Add a little perfume and I'm just going to touch up my makeup. Goldie should be almost finished with her homework. She already ate dinner so she can just get ready for bed and go to sleep. Okay, I ironed my hair and I should probably clean up a little bit. I don't know how the living room looks. Let's do a quick clean up. And yeah, it looks much better. And why is there a sand castle here? I told Goldie to get rid of it. I should have probably cleaned before getting ready. So just a little bit more perfume to make sure I smell nice and fresh and clean. Goldie, come down. Are you done with your homework? Yes, I'm finished. I'm so tired. I don't know why we need to learn all this history stuff. Why can't we just look to the future, look ahead and not look back? Well, I'm glad you did your schoolwork because tomorrow you have a test. Wait, wait, wait. Hmm, let me see, let me sniff you. <laughs> Golly, what are you doing? So, you're wearing your favorite perfume. You got all this new outfit on. All these signs point to one thing. What are you talking about? It's the new season of The Bachelor. And you and random grandma are gonna have a 
spewing party! <laughs> no, that's not it. The new season was cancelled. Huh, huh. But Goldie, it's getting late and you need to get a good night's nice rest if you want to do good on your test tomorrow. And you were so tired a minute ago from doing all that work, right? Hmm, I don't know about this. So, St. Patrick's Day party, huh? No, Goldie, there's no party. I am not going out anywhere. I'm not buying it. Do the hype, do the hype. There is no party, Goldie. Now please get upstairs, brush your teeth, take a bath, and get ready for bed, okay? Sure thing, Mom. Okay, Goldie, good night, sweet dreams. Oh, she fell asleep. She was really tired after all. So I'm getting some popcorn ready for my friend and I. So we can like watch a movie or something. So one popcorn for me. And I should probably get some cold drinks. Oh, it must be him. Hi, come in. Uh, hi, uh, mm, should I take off my shoes or... Uh, mm? No, it's okay. Just come in. Oh, wow. Hey, hey, this kitchen looks familiar. Oh, get it? <laughs> Funny, I, I guess. Anyway, thanks for inviting me over for a date. I mean, I'm kind of a good-looking police officer, so that's kind of understandable. Yeah, totally not a date. Just two new friends hanging out. Oh, yeah, of course. Why would anybody want to go out on a date with a good-looking police officer, top detective in the Blocksburg Police Department? We can watch a movie or something. I made some popcorn. Um, here, just help yourself and sit down. Let's see what's on TV. Oh yeah, definitely love this cooking show. These onions are ready to be cut, you know? This gives me inspiration when I'm going after criminals, helping old ladies cross the road, I'm just, that's who I am. I have a heart. I have feelings. Whoa, you just swallowed the whole popcorn. Let me try it out. Whoa. Are you okay? <coughs> are you, are you okay? Yeah. <coughs> yes. Yeah, let me just stretch my lungs a little bit. I love this part when they announce the winner. Let me just get a closer look. This is amazing. Uh, I will be right back. I need to go powder my nose. <laughs> yeah, just give me a second. Oh my gosh, this is so awkward. What did I get myself into? He seems like a really sweet and nice person, but he is also very cringy and kind of awkward and weird. But I can't just hide in my room. I need to go face him. Okay, everything's gonna be fine. Just go and watch a movie with him or a cooking show, whatever. Give this video a big thumbs up if you think this guy is totally cringy or tell me in the comments if you think I should give him a chance. Let's take a look at what's going on downstairs. Mm -hmm. Whoa, <gasps> stranger danger. Who is this guy? Hey, he looks familiar. Kinda looks like the guy on the cooking show. What is he doing, standing and watching the TV so closely? And is he dancing? What in the world? Should I call the police? Oh, but he is the police! Oh, there's Titi! She seems to not be alarmed! She's laughing at him dancing. So cringe.com! Uh, uh, are they? Is he? Is Titi on a date with him? Is that what her super secret was? This is real crazy. I need to see this for myself. Mm-hmm, with my own eyes. Not through the security camera. I don't believe this. It is true. What in the world is going on here? Hmm, 
Very, very interesting. How about we go outside and get some fresh air? Oh snap, they're going outside. I better go hop on, on the cameras again. Where are they going? Where are they going? Oh. Hey, that's my climbing wall, mister. What, are they, are they going up there together? What are they doing out there? Are they sitting there romantically looking at the stars? I think it's called like stargazing. Hmm. It's a really beautiful night. Definitely beautiful. These lights are just... They're... The star... The stars... Are, are you crying? <laughs> of course. Why would I... Why would I cry? What's going on now? They're gonna ice skate? But that's what me and Titi do together. It's our favorite activity. Uh, he's not even that good at ice skating. <laughs> Look, Titi's doing him her tricks and he's he fell down. <laughs> Woohoo! Wait, where are they going now? I think their date is over. Oh, I gotta switch the camera. They're probably gonna say goodbye to each other. <gasps> oh no, we all know what happens then. Is it? Okay. I can hear this. I wish there was sound. I can't hear what they're saying to each other. Why is he walking around like in circles? They're getting mighty close to each other. Oh no. Are they, are they gonna kiss? Oh. Okay. False alarm. False alarm. I think he's going now. Bye. Well, that wasn't so bad after all. Oh, I'm a little tired. Why are the lights off? I didn't turn the lights off. That's weird. Well, I better be quiet because I don't want Goldie to wake up and start asking all these questions. But I don't want to bump into stuff, so let me turn on the light here. Goldie? Oh, what are you doing up right now? You need to be sleeping. What's going on? The real question here is what are you doing up, Missy? We can do this the easy way or the hard way. Which way you want to go? The fun way or the hard way? What are you even talking about right now, Goldie? You need to go to sleep. You have a big test tomorrow. Well, well, I don't really like when people don't tell me the truth. So I'm going to give you one more chance to tell me the truth, Titi. Mm-hmm. Tell me all about your monkey business in the middle of the night. Tell me about your partying and that we say ice skating and doing all these flips and stuff on the ice. Mm-hmm. Stargazing. Does that ring a bell? Goldie, what are you, uh... Tell me, who is he? Who is that guy? Who is that boy? Tell me. Goldie, he is just a friend. He came over to watch a movie or a cooking show, and then I showed him the backyard. He was climbing my rock climbing wall. A friend, you say? I don't know many friends that I put like special perfume and outfit to see them and eat popcorn with them and sit and look under the stars and everything, TT. This outfit is not even new, and I always wear this perfume. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what they always say. You are making a big deal out of this, and now it's time for you to go back to sleep, okay? Well, thankfully for me, I recorded all the little date on the security camera footage. So I'm gonna go watch it. Bye! <gasps> Come back here, Goldie! How did you even get access to our security cameras? to the kitchen. I don't really feel like running right now. Do the floss. Do the floss. <laughs> um, Goldie came home a little upset today and I wanted to make sure that everything was okay in school. Oh uh, yeah. I don't want to talk about it. Yay! It's recess time. Finally, after a long day. Ooh, why is there a cake? I want some cake. Miss Alexis, I'm here. I have to 
take a potty break, but I want to play in the playground. Hi, Goldie. Can I pull your hair like yesterday? No? Go away! Come on, Goldie. It was funny. No, I don't want to. Go away! Come on, Goldie. Let's play. I don't want to. You're bothering me. I just want to go and play by myself here. I want to go on the up and down thingy. I guess I'll just go and hang out here next to the trail by myself. Oh, I'm sorry about it. Okay, you can come play with me if you really want to. Come on, let's go on the swings. Okay, let's go. Yay. Wee-hee. Casey, where are you? Casey. Goldie. Casey, where are you? Oh, I'm coming. Woo-hoo. Goldie, are you okay? Yeah, I just ate some sand. No biggie. Woo. Oh, what are those? They're flowers, duh. Well, you know, like, um, like, Valentine's Day just passed, and, like, I'm kind of late, but I didn't want to tell you before because, like, I was shy, and, um, well, I don't, like, have a crush on you or anything. I just think you're, like, nice. I like your hair. Uh, I like your strawberry onesie. Um, I think sometimes you're funny, just sometimes, not all the time. And do you like how I do the floss? Do the floss. Do the floss. Do the floss. Do the floss. <laughs> yeah, it's funny when you do it. Aww. Let's go on the seesaw. See and saw. And now we're stuck. Well, the bus is here. We have to go now. Let's go on the swings one last time. And then we'll run to the bus stop. Whee! Woohoo! Casey is really nice. <laughs> this is so much fun. It is, but we really have to go because the bus is going to leave us here in school. Let's run! Wait! Don't leave us! I want to go home! <laughs> Come on, Casey, hurry! <laughs> okay, you want to sit with me? Oh, uh, yeah, I do. Okay, it's time to go home. Oh no, I left the flowers Casey gave me on the playground. Oh, well I guess it's better I did because Daisy's going to start asking all these questions and, and I don't even know how I feel about it. Oh, but I think I have a crush on Casey. But but what if Daisy gets mad because I'm too little? I don't even know what to do. Oh, well, I gotta go home. I'll, I'll pretend everything is okay. Oh, Goldie's home. Hey, Goldie, how was your day? Hi, TT. Tell me all about it. What's going on? How was your spelling test? Did you do okay? Oh, uh, yeah, I guess. Okay, uh, is everything okay? You're acting a little bit weird. Uh, everything is fine, I guess. Are you sure? Is there anything special that happened at school today that you want to tell me? I, uh, no, I, just, I went to the playground, I had art class, and then, uh, yeah, I don't want to talk about it. Uh, okay. That definitely does not sound like everything is all right. Goldie, you know you can talk to me. Where is she? Did she lock her door? Goldie? Can I come in? Can you please leave me alone for a little bit? Uh, okay. I'll come check up on you in a couple of minutes. That is so weird. Why is she acting like that? She usually comes back super happy from school. Hmm. I should probably call her teacher, Miss Alexis, and see if everything's okay. Hello, Miss Alexis. Yeah, it's TD. Um, Goldie came home a little upset today, and I wanted to make sure that everything was okay in school. Yeah, everything is fine. She was playing in the playground with her little friend Casey, and she looked really happy. He even got her little flowers. They are the cutest, you know? Uh, maybe Goldie has a little crush. 
Oh, okay, so everything else is fine? Well, well great, <laughs> thank you so much. Huh, would you look at that? <laughs> I think I know what's going on. Goldie has a crush, and she's probably being really shy about it. Oh, this is too cute. I need to talk to her. I also don't want to be like super pushy and awkward about it, but she needs to be able to tell me these things, right? Uh, Goldie! Can I come in? I guess so if you really need to. So, I talked to your teacher, Ms. Alexis. About what? Mm, not about your day. I wanted to make sure that everything was fine. And she told me you had a wonderful day. Yeah, I was pretty okay, I guess. Um, how about we get some ice cream? I know how much you love ice cream. Come on. Ice cream makes everything better. Okay. Goldie. <laughs> Come on, I'll race you to the kitchen. I don't really feel like running right now. But you know that I really love ice cream and I could never pass up a free ice cream cone. <laughs> exactly. Let's go sit on the couch. Let's have a chat. Eat some ice cream. Talk about your day. Doesn't ice cream just make you want to talk about your feelings? What? I don't know. So, Goldie, you know you can tell me anything, right? Yeah. Is there anything you want to talk about? I don't know. It's personal, but maybe I'll whisper it in your ear. Okay. I have a crush on a boy. Oh, Goldie, that's... I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. Oh, you guys, Goldie has her very first crush. And I think, well, I know, she is very shy about it. I can remember my first crush like it was yesterday. Goldie, you know you can tell me anything. Okay, well, his name is Casey, and he's really nice, and, and he likes to dance, and he's, he's really good at drawing, and he also is learning how to play the guitar after school. Wow, it seems like you know a lot about your friend Casey. And like I really like to play with him in the playground and like he makes me smile and he gave me a flower today but I didn't bring it. I kind of forgot and I don't know because sometimes he also pulls my hair and I don't like that but I told him to stop and then he stopped and... Uh-huh. But like I don't even know if I want to like marry him or like even hold his hand. I don't know, I'm just really confused about it and it's all very weird. Well, Goldie, Casey sounds like a great little boy, and you are just a little girl, so I wouldn't worry about it, just have fun, and it seems like he's a really nice friend. You don't have to be shy about it, I think it's totally normal, and it's nice for you to share your feelings with me. So, maybe you can even invite him over for a play day one day, or for lunch, that would be fun. <sighs> That would be fun. I feel much better telling you all about it because I was a little shy about it, you know? Of course. We can ask him to come over for a play date, but like after school he usually plays the guitar with his daddy and then sometimes they go to the playground and then sometimes he goes to the grocery store. So I don't know how, uh, how free he is to come have a play date with me because he looks like a busy person. Wow, Goli, you know a lot about him. I mean, just a little bit. I'm not like stalking him or anything, you know? Um, he just told me this stuff the other day at the playground. Hey guys, how about you give Goldie some advice on her new crush? And would you like to see Goldie and Casey hanging out? Maybe having a play date or something? If so, tell me down in the comments. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next video. But tell them not to tell all their friends about my crush. It's a secret and it's personal. Okay, Goldie. Hey, did you sneak an ice cream? <laughs> see you guys next time. Woohoo, let's go play.